Good day, everybody. We are here at the legendary Iron Duke Dock, but this was a dock before we know it today. We have two ladies with us. They're going to introduce themselves. We're going to start with Kit Inspector Jilts, followed by, what's your title again? Matron. Matron. Edith. Miller. Barker Miller. Okay, so we'll start with Miss Jilts. Tell us your name, introduce yourself to us, tell us who you are, and tell us how you came to know this dog. Well, I, I am Barbara Jilts, right. Kit Inspector. I joined the landship in 69, and I had much stay at, stay at the Irwin Joke. I went over to the Bayless director. I went over the director in 1993, and I was there till I can't drill no more. Okay, when you came up in Iron Duke, tell us a little bit about those years. Well, when you came up, under who, who was in charge then, and where was it located? It was located down in, um, where I got down there? Live further down there in Lakers Village, at Perch House. Just down to right. the second gap there? Mm. Right, mm -hmm. at Leon Perch. Leon Perch. At Leon Perch. Who introduced you to the Iron Duke Dock? Well, Nobody introduced me to Iron Duke Dock. There was drilling in the gas station where it is now, and me and the woman named Elaine Bell. So there was the first command was open all the march and close all the march. So the, gen, the commander told me, Barbie, you don't move. But I look and see what's going on, and I am a quick learner. And when he found me, said for the door, what they were doing. How you get to join the landship in the first I place? just see them drilling down there the night. In the gas station, the industry was shut off, and they were drilling down there. So I just, the, the, I went and went to the drilling. I find the, the drilling, and I said, well, I, I told the woman that was with me that I like this movement. She said, I like it too, and I going, I said, well, I'm going to drill, you going with me? And the both of us, the put we on different partners, cause we know coming and put the two of, us, two of us together. So she like she ain't get her to do, but I get mine. Do. I get I do mine. <laughs> and you had to ask anybody to to do the drills, or you just want to start drilling? I saw them, uh -huh. but I told you I'm a quick learner, so I just follow what they were doing and they anyway it too. So when the man said, "Well, I ain't gonna learn you nothing, cause let you doing it with them." And they was going to church the Sunday morning. And next morning, the when, when we away was in uniform, I was in the uniform with them. And everybody that in there they were, oh, this body is mine, no she. But I get uniforms so quick. Baby, I got a cousin, my uncle trained is near work here, and they patched me at the night. I go well say so. <laughs> <laughs> I got <laughs> and we work for the they work for me and tell me sir the machine the, 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 the uniform was ready. And what rank you went in as? Uh, uh, um, a nurse. A, a dinky, nurse. dinky nurse. What was a dinky nurse? A young a nurse. Dinky we didn't do nothing, but we only did because we were young. The, din the dinky nurses was like the small, small ones yeah. that got to watch the big ones. Yeah. So you call us the dinky nurses. So y'all were all children then? She was a child, but not me. You were a big woman yeah, by the I time did. you joined? Yeah, I was in my 20s. I was in my 20s in 69. And who gave you that rank, the dinky nurse? The, them, them tell me I was a nurse. They tell me, oh, they tell me that I was a nurse. So I had to wait and to come up to the position that I, I, I leave the lunch in the kitchen inspector. So that it means to see that your clothes clean, because if your clothes clean, clean, you can come from parade. I remember in 73, we went to Highland to swear in the Aaron Duke. Not the Not the, the director, the director. BLS director. And the man that Marshall said, oh, kid inspector nurses fall. Can inspect the admiral captain for no, not the captain. Can inspect the and admiral follow the right place. I refused to move, but I didn't know that the man knew my right. That is commander marshal, and he said I had moved. He come to me there. 
what I told you, I ain't told you to move. Get move, not like I talk, eh? You can stand from down the gap and hear you. Not down the, the, the road. I mean down the gap, so you know. <laughs> yeah. It said we tell fall and out the lady. Fall out the lady, fall out the right. Why you didn't want to move? Because they say all oh, these people here, we get we, what do you mean? There was nothing, you know? All the nurses, all everybody went up to um all they went up to the yard, Highland Yard to drill. And I refused. And he made me, me come out the light and we had to drill, we had to see after them. They met the look good and we he ain't drill me, but he drilled them. When you say swearing in, explain to us what you mean by swearing in. Well, you had to go on the flag and swear what you have to do from what you're in to do. Which flag is this? The, Barb the national, Barbados national flag. And who swear you in? Um, it was who the, the admiral that, the um, commander marshal, commander marshal. I can't remember, but yes, no. <laughs> and where did they, he swore you in where? Uh, a place in Highland at um, St. Thomas. St. Thomas near the Bright Star. The Bright Star. Where were you sworn in, Rosie? Tell us about that experience. When were you sworn in? Well, I can't remember the date now that I swore in, but I know when I swore in, I was like this tall, right? Because by my father, my father was one of, my father, the name Charles Carter, he was one of the leading members of the shape. It was my father, my mother, my brother, and me. My whole family. But I was like the little dainty nurse, you know, in the shape. So I had all the, I had all the right. So I swear on the, well, the dog wasn't like this. It was just a, a little, a little dog, right? But we used to make it feel like if it is a, a big dog, because we, we want to go, we, we need to go in the Iron Duke dog. You see, like, how it, well, it's it not the Iron Well, the Iron Duke still carrying the swing too, but we used to say the Iron Duke dog. So, then my father, my father tell me, my father, the name Charles Carter, and he tell me, I wear the dinky nurse. I say, aye, aye, sir. He said, fall out. So I had to, like, one step backward and two step forward, right? He said, give me some, show me some actions of what you was taught. That time I small now, but I got to remember because I don't want nobody holler at me because they used to holler. Did it? Yes, yes. They used to holler at you. A lady nurse! Huh? Uh, you know, I just shout like that, and you know that would tremble you. So I used to, <laughs> I used to got my, for my T's and my Q's. And although my father was the leading man, he didn't used to make no sport with me. Because he said, if he makes sport with me, I would, the rest will feel that there it is a sport making something. Yes, it is a sport making something, but not carrying it down to the lowest degree. So my father tell me, you know it's supposed to be the leading dinky nurse. God, you used to call us dinky nurses. I come in the landship from in a blue uniform with an apron, lap in the back, lap in the back, and black shoes. That time we didn't used to wear no stockings. Stockings only come up when we get up big. Socks, white socks. And the commander, when you have on your shoes, whether it's blue, brown, pink, or white, the commander will come and hold down so. Uh, if he didn't see your face, his face in his shoe, hmm? he asks you to step out of the line, go home and clean your shoes and come back. Don't care what part you live. If you, if you live in the area, get somebody that live in the area, get one dinner. Because then you should go at me or Mr. Reese over there, 
the news to go by him. Well, not really by him, but his mother and thing. And she would say, you all know what you all is to do, what you all want to do it. And she would shine up the shoes. And then we come back, by the time, well, the dog wasn't like this, you know. But by the time we get back here, the, the kid inspector at the door with the face down. Not to see if she could see her face in the shoe, right? And at the time, they said, Dinky Nurse Miller, right? Because that was what they used to call me first. Dinky Nurse Miller, one step backward. I said, well, shoot, she like, she didn't say him out. <laughs> one step forward. And I come forward. Then I come forward. The inspector there now, that time go all around me, you know, all around me. Inspector. He ain't touching me because, you know, he, he would be the man, you know. But he would got the lady, a little, a little nurse, you know. And she would come and have the uniform and go. <laughs> she fixing it up on the shoulder and thing. So when I passed my inspection, they would give me a clap. And when I come in then, they would say, we are going to give you a position, but we are not telling you what is the position. So, but my father was in the shape. He went home and rest for the position to me, right? So, then I come back out now. We, we was going, I can't really remember where was our first, like, out, right? But I know then we going out now. We were lined up from, well, the dot wasn't like this. It was a little too a warm with something, right? So we were lined up from that corner there, the corner down there. We were lined up from down there, and comma the commander near Commander Burroughs, right? The commander would be all up here. We down there, the commander all up there. And we have to listen. And everybody have to move to time. And I would hear the commander shout, Dinky Nurse Miller! Mm -hmm. I get frightened now because I thought I'd do something, right? <laughs> I get frightened because you know you got to be playing your T's and your Q's and that time my head up in the air and my hand at my side. And then he said, the shit is about to move off. Dinky Nurse Miller, you are the leading one. One step, two step forward, Bram Bram. <laughs> two step backward, Bram Bram. Listen for the order. Anyhow, I listening for the order. So then I move off. The rest is supposed to move off with me. The command, that time the commander all up here, you know, and we all down there. You got to listen. Listen. The commander said, the ship is about to sail. And I look back. I, I, I move, I just glance back to save everybody, you know, straight. So the commander was saying, Dinky Nurse Miller, your shit is in order. Yes, sir. We are ready to sail. Right, sir. He said, so then, then we get ready now. He was, the, the band, the band would be up here, and the band would strike up. Then the band strike up. All of us, you know, be straight. He said, take, take down your chest. Just relax, you know? Because then chest up there, the commander feels that we are not comfortable, right? He was say, take down your chest, and we, we are about to, to move off. Anyhow, then he move off. That time, that time, this gap, the two sides. That time, he, he, people knew, sir. Really, especially when they hear the, the commander birds, commander birds got the land shit parading. And then that time the commander had 
a loud voice. You could hear him from Masini Belgali. Yes, his voice, because you know you have to have a loud voice, right? And the commander was saying, the ship is getting ready to sail. All the members should be in order. So that we no trying to maneuver no one, wrinkle up and wrinkle up, and put myself in order. That time I touch my partner now. <laughs> Stand up straight and don't let the commander see. But I can, you know, I would think she saw, <laughs> and we would hold up the chest, because we chest will have to be up in the air so that the rest would not, well, they, when they move off, they're dressed in that time, that time we up in, I can see it. I can see it. That time we, we saw, right? We up in the air, and that, we staying up like this. Head up, and then we move off. You move off with your right foot, and your hand going like this, you know? And we marching and coming up. And then we get, we thought now that we can stop by the land ship dock. We ain't stopping by the land ship dock. We doing a parade, and we going right up, right up the main road, right up the main road, through the bell tenor, and come back. And the land ship dock then will be the last stop then, right? So the commander will ask us, you all tired? We want another drill now, so we can say, we say no. One night we went to Buckley Factory for this, huh? <laughs> hold on, hold on, Miss Rosie. Let me, let me hear Kit Inspector now. Um, how did you move from, I want to ask you a question, how you move from nurse to Kit Inspector? How you get yeah. that promotion? First, we got told that we call her, call her dinky nurse, but we call on her young people stars. We call her, we call her. Yeah, every ship had a different we, we name. We were stars. You were star. you wasn't a dinky nurse. No, no, we were stars. Every ship had a different Up name. Up to now, we are still called the nurses stars. All right, this is the Iron Duke versus the director. Exactly. How you got from the nerd, or you was a star, you telling me now? I was the star with the blue, and I went from Shh. the star, I went to the star, to a surgeon nurse. What did that involve? You had to get a next swearing in? You had to do a, something? No, I had, to, I had to get no more swearing in. They put me as a surgeon nurse, and then they said, uh, um, you can inspect the date and they want somebody to act as surgeon nurse. And I, I was like the last person I was in. Surgeon nurse, tell us what surgeon nurse. We used to wear a green, a green bed, a, a, like, a, like, a, um, like a real nurse, all right? And you think that he's a nurse. What were your duties? Um, we used to do, we had to look after the small ones, the small ones too. The dinky, the dinky, yeah, the dinky, the dinky, the dinky, the dinky, dinky, dinky stars. Oh, stars. You just said, look after <laughs> the stars. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. So you move up then from surgeon nurse to kid inspector. Yeah. Because some, so yeah. it's only when somebody passed away then that you yeah. will move into that yeah. position. Yeah. Okay. So who told you then that they will move you into the kid inspector? My captain at the time. Who, well, who was your captain at the time? We're in a watch captain, Watson. Can you remember what, um, what year this was? I can't remember what was. About in the, it was 70, it was about the 1980. Now, did he, um, you express an interest to be a uh, kid inspector? Yeah, I said that. Well, I, you, you can remember that conversation? I can't remember, no, because that is 40 years now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but you told him that you wanted to. Yes, me, say, Bob, if you were a kid inspector, you would accept. I told him yes. And since then, my daughter moved to. Surgeon nurse. Okay. And she was also, a, she was a star first and then? Yeah, she was a star. So yeah. as the girls go in, then they're stars and then they move up? Yeah. They move up according yeah. to the, the drilling. The, and the drilling. According to the drilling and, and she, the commander see she, the drilling. She is. He's moved them. Yeah, she. So she got to work on that, she will come with them. Okay. Now, tell us some of your duties as a kid inspector. Well, I used to look to see that the children, if your clothes clean, if your shoes clean, if any part you clean, that you could go up on people parade. 
if you clean, you can you can come on that parade. But if you're getting something, Barbara, if you command and you should go and shoes, your shoes have to be clean. Hold on, mm -hmm. hold on, yeah, yeah, and see, see if you can see his shoes, face yeah. in your shoe. shoe. No, you used to inspect everybody or just the children. No, everybody. Oh, inspect the whole the squad. squad. Watch me like watch you line up. You got to. She is the kid that, inspector that for that the that whole squad. He called me from when the director swear in. 72 or 73, I was a kid inspector then. So it had to be 480, about 73, because they called me out the, the, the commander marshal said, oh, kid inspector followed the, followed the rank. Mm -hmm. So I had to ins inspect the, even the captain. So only women were kid inspectors? No, or they no, had they men? had men too. 72, but he died in 73. Yeah, 72. We swear in 72. So. Now listen, when, when little boys went in then, they were stars or there was something out? There was something, is this what that means? Blue jacket, blue jacket, because they had the jacket to suit. Some was blue jackets and some was sailors. Yeah, all we can, we can uh, blue jacket, the earned you. And the, under the directive is the same thing? Yeah, the directive is uh, blue jacket. Blue jacket. Okay, talk to me about the, um, about the dock before it was the dock you know today, because you all seem to remember the dock as it was. The dock was a, 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 a host like with, um, what could it call the girl? Oh, you don't hurt your brain, let me tell her. <laughs> don't hurt your brain. Yes, Rosie, tell us. <laughs> the dock before this one was a, 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 to be, a, a, a two gable house, right. And it was a kind of, it didn't break down, but it was good enough for me to drill, right? And we get the, the Landship Association get that as a gift. Cause I may as well, let me, let me go, let me go again. It was me and a lady named Miss Small, a lady named Miss Biner, we used to take Night I met day. <laughs> we were walk about in the day. I'm speaking the truth. Everybody in here don't know, I, I telling them. Barbara will remember a little bit. We used to take there because we mean that we must have a dog on this spot. So we will walk about in the day and if we see anybody old house. Well not all on broken down, <laughs> but that we could get boards and things off of it. We will go back, we the women, you know, we the women. We ain't, got, we ain't can't long the man cause the man might talk. <laughs> the man might talk, but we ain't gonna talk. So if it is your house over there, we coming, we coming for couple boards and couple uh, what? We had one of the nurses that did a real man. She would take down the house. And we were, we were work it, we were work it by night. Then like, like then, then the road clear, you know? Then the road clear. I used to tell them we want that. And we come in for that tonight. So then we get it here now. We get here, then we get here now. My father, my father and Commander Burns want to know where we get this here from. He said, my father used to tell me, listen to me. Where you get that from? I said, Daddy, I want some place to drill in. And, and I went looking about in the day, and I, I find this here, and we went back for it by night. You said, Fair enough, daughter. <laughs> <laughs> what, what he, look, I find you know I'm, I'm telling the lies. Fair enough, daughter. And look, we ain't paying a carpenter to put it up, you know. The, the nurses help, and the men help, call me one dog. We want a dog. We get this spot, cause the, the owner, there where the, above, just above this house there where you see that, that um, house above that house, the house, the house, the spot below the gas station, the lady there, she give us this spot. Miss Marshall, right, she give us this spot. And she said, I'm not giving you all to put when a house pan, I'm giving you all this spot to put 
the barbarous orange dog pan. Because that was our, the name of our shake, right? I said, but you can't put the orange juice on. You, every ship got to come to this dock because we're going to name it the main dock. So then it became the main dock. And you come here, you see enough members in here. They are land ship members. You see, fair enough, Rosie. I know you will get it work out. And we bring, we bring, and then we come in. If, if a board got a hole, we messing up the wall. Then, then, then the commander was just say, up. And then the commander said, up, we know a hole behind there. So we are going back. <laughs> we coming forward. We are going back. <laughs> if you say, that time, that time I was going as Mayor as Dinky Miller. Dinky Miller. Look around and see what is wrong. I say, sir. I haven't seen anything wrong. He said, you want to follow the line? I said, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir. I will look again, sir. No, sir, no, sir. He said, look again. I said, excuse me, sir. I now find the little hole, sir. He said, but you know that little hole would become a big hole and somebody would fall in it. I said, sir, but you know, a small, because I did all this rude. A small, but I didn't really know what what damage it will make. So my father stepped in now. Um, Commander Birds, and Commander Birds will say, "Aye, aye, sir." That was the that was the answer, you know, because he had answered. So my father will say, "What you are doing with the dinky nurse?" He said, "I asked the dinky nurse the question." And she refused to answer me. So I had to ask her all over again. And she found me an answer. My father said, fair enough. Anyhow, so then we, we used to have practice every Friday night. Fair contribution as usual. If you got 40 cents, you put it in. If you, if you ain't got no money, you go wrong and a nurse would ease a little dollar or something, but you're not getting a dollar like now. Well, he's a little dollar in your hand, I tell you. Put that, put that, put that there, so that when we go, no, you will go long. I said, but whether I put money or not, I got to go. <laughs> I'm not letting this shit leave me and my large hill and it going out. All right, matron, let me hear from Kit Inspector now. Dark nights or Friday nights? You can remember what used to happen on Friday nights? We used to go on Monday, yeah, on Friday night, and we used to go to meeting, and we had a a, um, a man at the door. He can't remember his name, but he would say um, he got to alert the captain that he coming. And if if you call, if the man call, if the man call and what's an answer, you can't get in the door. You got to call when you refuse to give your name. Where he say, um, Captain, this body is coming, and you don't. The he don't say who you is, you can't get any job. Branch, 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 branch. 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 What was his rank? We break this again, just. We can't remember, are you not? Um, so he used to stand up at the door? Yeah, he did central. He was central. Not the central. They have, does it please? Made it please. Do you call the Central or the Centurion? Military Police. Military Police.